Hello everybody, Super Duper Boy here, and today I'm going to be ranking all of the fight scenes in Godzilla King of the Monsters, the Titan fights, and I'm going from least favorite to my favorite ones. Um, now this is just my personal opinion. If you have a different opinion about it, then please don't get mad at me. If, um, if you want to debate it about it in the comments, then please do it respectfully. And I would like to say I do I, I like even the one that's lowest on this list because all the fights are pretty cool. So yeah, I'm just going to get into my list. So at number six, I'm going to be putting Rodan versus King Ghidorah. Now, I feel as this was the only fight where I was a little bit disappointed. Now, I understand that Ghidorah was supposed to completely destroy Rodan. That's kind of like the point of the fight. Um, And it shouldn't... I'm, I'm, I'm fine with it not being that long of a fight. I just... I hate how they... The second, the second um, Rodan and Ghidorah collide, it just immediately goes to this not as important subplot with the humans. And I'm usually pretty generous to humans in, in like the movies because I think they're not too bad. But in this one, it just annoyed me because they completely ignored most of the fight, and I think we missed a lot of it because it. Um, after all of that human stuff happened, then Ghidorah finally. Um, shot like Rodan into the water which was actually a pretty f cool finishing move how he like stretched out the wings and then shot Rodan with the gravity beams I do think that part was pretty cool but but like that was a, a a little while after they first made contact so I'm sure there was a big fight that we kind of missed and so I just wish it was at least at least like 30 seconds of just fighting but we only got a few scenes so that's why it's low the lowest on my list Next up at number five is Godzilla versus King Ghidorah. But this was their round two in the water right after the Rodan fight. Um, it was a pretty tough choice between this and number four, but I settled on this one. Um, I do like this fight. I think it has, it's a lot better than King Ghidorah versus Rodan. And it was pretty cool how Godzilla was just beating up Ghidorah because it was underwater and that's where Godzilla is. My, my only problem with this fight, though, my problem is that a lot of the shots were way too close to the monsters. Um, it was a little bit hard to see what was going on in the fight. It wasn't too bad, but it was just a little hard to see what was going on. Um, I, I don't think, think this is a bad fight, though. Um, I still thought it was pretty cool. I think it would have been interesting if like, they actually traveled underwater, like in this concept art of... Ghidorah and Godzilla fighting like underwater, but they mostly stand on the surface, which is fine, I suppose. Um, also, the oxygen destroyer explosion was really cool, but I'm not going to really be counting it as part of the fight because that's kind of when the fight ended. I think it was pretty cool. Um, you set up the after credit scene, so yeah, it was a, it was a pretty good fight. It's just that um, it had it had some minor flaws, and the ones above I like even more. But still, yeah, cool fight. At number four, I'm going to be putting Burning Godzilla versus King Ghidorah, or well, now he's not king; he's not the king anymore in this fight. He's just, just he's just Ghidorah, um, or Fire Godzilla, whatever. <laughs> um, so this this wasn't really that much of a fight, so that's why it's not too long on my list. But because Ghidorah did try and fight back by shooting gravity beams at Godzilla's chest, and he just Godzilla just sucked it up and blew up Ghidorah. Um, I still count it as a fight. The, it, though it was quick, a quick scene, it was really awesome. It was absolutely genius how how they made it so Mothra's wings came out in the explosion. That was a really great decision. And this was just an amazing scene with the music, the visuals, all of that. Um, it wasn't that long or big of a fight, so I'm not gonna. I'm obviously not gonna put it too high on my list, but definitely a great a great moment in fight. It was really awesome to see. Next up is. Godzilla versus Ghidorah round one. This was a pretty good fight. It was it was very long. Um, well not very long, but it was it was pretty long and it had it had some great moments. I do like how Ghidorah dodged the gravity memes and then just blasted Godzilla in the chest, and that was that was pretty cool. So this was just a good solid fight. Um, those the only reason it's not at the top of my list is because there's some other fights I just slightly prefer over this one. Also, the scene has some really amazing looking shots that were like this one with Godzilla and Ghidorah standing off to each other. There was a lot of really good looking moments in this. Probably my favorite part of this fight, though, is when 
Godzilla just busts out of the ice and the music starts playing. That was just so awesome. That was one of the best scenes in in the movie, in my opinion. And then they roared at each other. That was really great. Um, this fight, when it comes to problems, there's really not much. Um, Graham's death was like unnecessary and shouldn't have happened. But that wasn't really part of the fight, so I won't be counting it. But yeah, this was a really great fight, and that's why it gets to go on number three on my list. Next up at number two is Rodan and Mothra. In my opinion, this is one of the best fights in the movie. Um, I'm not. I, I don't really have any definitive reasons like why I like it more than the battle in Antarctica. I just do. For some reason, I just slightly prefer it. It was one of the few fights that surprised me because for most of the other fights, I kind of knew what was going to happen. Um, the like the fight, um, Godzilla versus Ghidorah of round two was a little bit unexpected, but this 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 part of the fight, I had no clue who, what was going to happen. I wasn't sure who was going to win or any of that, and it was super cool when they fought on that building and Mothra just stabbed Rodan with her stinger. That was one of the coolest scenes. It was definitely surprising because I thought Rodan was dead. I was like, wow, okay. They just kill off Rodan. I was, I was a little bit mad for a second, but I'm glad he came back. This was just a really entertaining fight with modern CGI and all of that. So I think it gets to go on number two on my list. I was on the edge of my seat. It was definitely really cool to watch. It was also very fast-paced, so I definitely liked that. So now I'm going to go on to number one, which should be obvious. It's Godzilla vs. King Ghidorah, the final battle. Just the Godzilla vs. King Ghidorah part, not the Rodan vs. Mothra part. This fight was just... I don't, I don't think I really have to explain. It was just so cool. There were so many cool cool scenes. My favorite part is when Ghidorah lo- like, could see the reflection of Godzilla in the building, and then Godzilla just just pushed him through the building and... That, that was so cool. Um, we got to see Mothra and Godzilla do some teamwork, and Godzilla was all powered up, all that stuff. I, I think the amount they cut back to the humans was almost perfect. I think it should have focused a tiny bit more on the monsters, because there might have been a little bit we missed of the fighting. But for the most part, it balanced out the humans and monsters pretty well in this fight. Well, I really like the part where, where it was like the soldier's point of view from like from below, and the monsters were battling above them, um, Ghidorah. And Godzilla, that was some, that was something really cool. Godzilla got to use his atomic breath in a lot of awesome ways. I could go on for like forever, but it should be obvious why this is one of the best fights, um, Godzilla fights ever, if not the best. Because I, I I'm I'm really not sure if I like the Muto fight or this one more. Um, because I think they were both pretty good. This one definitely might have might be better though, because it did it did it was more light up, which is a huge improvement how it was all how it wasn't super dark and impossible to see so that was great so that is my list do you agree with me do you disagree with me let me know in the comments below and thank you all so much for watching and i will see you all next time